Welcome back everybody. In today's video, we have a frauditor that decides to audit an Air Force plant for some reason. I have no idea why. And then he gets confronted by the police and they question his sanity because he's acting very strange. Enjoy the video. So we're out here of uh, Raytheon, US Air Force plant. So. Here's our marker for private property. Just to make sure that we continue walking this way. This is a uh, US Air Force plant number 44 is operated by Raytheon. Permission to pass over revocable at any time. I've never seen a sign like this, but okay. You know frauditors get very excited when they see a sign they haven't seen before. They're like, let me take a picture, let me add it to my collection. This is Raytheon, U.S. Air Force plant. You're now entering a safe workplace. No firearms, no drugs. What are you doing? All right, I'm gonna fast forward it a little bit because right now he's just gonna stick around like an idiot for like maybe 15 minutes. So I'm sure you guys don't wanna see that. Let's move to the police interaction. Am I being detained? Well, is that your car or no? It I'm is. About to tow it. Why? Because that plate doesn't belong on that car. Run the plate correctly. Okay, let's go see no, it. No, no, I don't need to go if see that's it. That's your car. You can it's leave it if you zero, want, but I'm going to tow the car. Ocean 95, not 095. It's Ocean 95, not 095. Run it correctly first. Okay, fair enough. No, no, go run it. So you're going to go that way or you're going to go I'm with your car? I'm going to stay right here while you run it. I want to hear what you run. Do you have an earpiece in? Sounded like you were sounded like you were walking off when I walked up to you. Sounded or looked like. Can you uh, run the vehicle as an ocean? So I think this guy could be a good frauditor because one, he has attitude, two, he's a know-it-all, and three, he's also a smart ass. Well so far that's three for three. All he needs is the criminal record and the bad hygiene and he's good to go. Instead of a zero on the last three, please. Do you know that zeros have dots in the middle, right? Some, O's don't. Some states do that. Some, some states don't. do, but would some you not don't. run it the other way when it doesn't come back to the same vehicle? Wouldn't that be common sense? No. Nope. Really? Arizona doesn't do that, so. So wouldn't be common Arizona, sense to say, oh, maybe I ran it, maybe it could be an O, not a zero? You guys really should be here watching the 60 cars. They're running this light over and over and over. I have a real hard time hearing you. Would you cars do something? Run this light over and over again. I've caught 60 people in the last hour. Oh, 16? 60. 60. 6 0. Okay. Not 6 ocean, 6 0. Gotcha. All right. There goes another one. Look at that. They can turn right on red here. Now. They have to stop first. They don't have to. They have to That's not even able to get out. Really? I was looking at You guys are fucking with me? When you ran my plate wrong, get the fuck out of here. I'm sitting here filming the vehicles that keep running this light. He just saw three of them running. Well, you know in front the best way to deal with that is to let us know about it because you're here we go. How am I gonna help you know about it if I'm standing here doing it? You could come talk to us at the station. I would send you the we'll video. We'll after, I would send you the evidence after have, I collect it. I have to collect. I have to collect like the that. evidence hey, first. You yes, I do. It. So this guy is an anarchist. He hates the police, but yet he wants to snitch on people that are turning right on a red light. Like, what the hell is he talking about? And what are you guys gonna do? Nothing about it. Nothing. That's not true. You're right. We have okay. we have motorcycles that do that all day. Yeah. Not sit here. Well, not here. I almost got hit three different times. I'm 
come here because I almost got T-boned three different times by employees coming out of this well, place. What is recording it gonna do? Evidence against these people, so you guys believe me. Because I believe you. you do. Yeah. The people when I call don't. Yeah. I've called, I've made complaints, they don't care. Did you call? Two I'm weeks, help like two weeks ago, two and a half okay. weeks ago. Who did you speak with? Uh, I don't remember. We can leave so you can here just like you can. That's so fine. you can't dismiss us. I if can you want us you. to help you with you, your traffic You work problem. for me, I don't work for you, bud. So if you want us to help you with your I don't need your help right now. Because you guys, he this. just watched three people run that light and did nothing. Did you just witness three people break the law? That's a green arrow. So you got to watch the arrow, too. No, no. When, when this car. light is green, that light is not. I saw a couple cars just let here. This light was red, and they had a green arrow. Bye. That was one of the most Karen and pointless audit I've ever seen in my entire life. Just completely pointless. Who would watch this unironically and think you did anything good here? I get your business card. I can't walk over there. Can I get your business card? I can't walk over there. His too. His also. His too. Also his. Okay. <clears throat> we got car 306 and 4104. <laughs> now, now we're gonna play more games. So you do admit that you're playing games. Okay, that's good. Try to look up further information. I would have walked over there, but I'm assuming that blue line creates railroad property. I didn't want to go on to somebody else's property. Uh, that's what my Unless they have marked signage or a fence or something, they can't keep you from walking over there. I, I play, play it safe. Okay, fair enough. Name Thanks, badge man. on the back is our event number. Okay, so awesome. So there will be an incident for it. An incident report for it. There's no. a there's an, an event, event number. number. Right. Because we got so a call. I, I, I get the difference. Gotcha. I can get the cab report, the dispatch audio, but there won't be a written incident report for it. Will you guys write an incident report? I don't know how they report? do it in records. Like he's saying, so if there's not a case, you can still get the audio of like... Or, or not necessarily no, so audio, the way it but works there's be dispatch records and CAD records. Right, so sure. you can get that stuff MCTs, up. things like, like that. To a certain time. Yeah. The problem is they delete that stuff a lot sooner if there's no case report pulled. Okay. So, so if it's just an event number, it's only a, held for so many days. So if I want to get all that information... There would have to be a case report pulled. You, I would get it sooner than later. Yeah. Okay. If you wait, you won't. it won't be available. They deleted it because they're road. like, oh, there's the no criminal is. charges, there's no right. civil infractions. So this won't even be a case number because there's no crime. And I'm sorry to give you guys a hard time. Right. Don't worry about it, man. Okay, man. If you, it's just, my take on this, if you have a legitimate concern for this, I can help you with it. I do. But a lot but, of times we run across people I've, who don't I've even want to talk to I've us. I've called before like, and talking to somebody on the spot or talking to somebody on the phone does not help. I've learned that lesson, which is why I'm documenting, getting evidence of it. Fair enough. And like you said, that arrow is green sometimes. So he was trying to request the body cam footage and trying to get that information, but why? It's like barely anything happened. You just acted like a complete Karen. They checked on you and they left, but you're so desperate to add that to your video. Anyways, I don't even know who this guy is. I don't remember when I found this video, but he's a very low tier frauditor. Moving on to the next clown. Here's a video of SGV acting like such an asshole that even his own fans tell him that he really dropped the ball this time. Check it out. Guys. So as you guys can see, he's currently auditing a junkyard, 
to make sure the tyrants are treating the junk properly and the junkyard actually created privacy by having a fence even with spikes on it but yet sgv news is using his stick to go over the privacy that they created just to push people's buttons but even that's not going to work You guys want to I'll take you guys in the yard. So instead of doing the creepiness with the cameras over the fence, this gentleman is offering them a tour of the junkyard. But yet, the only thing they know how to do is speak in that stupid made up language that doesn't make any sense just to be disrespectful. And that's why even SGV's own fans were very disappointed in this video. Why am I so bitches? I don't get it though. Oh yeah, for sure, dude. No, 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 no. I, hey, hey, real shit, dude. I respect what you guys doing. I'm not against the media at all. I'm just kind of curious. Like, shit, I want to take pictures. No biggie. I don't give a fuck what y'all do. I was just going to give you guys a tour in the damn yard. Why take over the fence when you can get up close and personal of the shit? That's... I'm just a friendly guy, bro. I just, huh? Oh yeah, I like the cheese actually, but no, I'm just, I'm just wondering. I was gonna allow you guys to go in the yard and walk around, check out the trucks and shit. I mean, but you guys wanna act like you guys don't speak English? I guess. Oh, oh, here. Oh, yeah, here. Second, one minute, yeah, let's go. Let's call it. Great job, SGV News. You know, this guy was nice. He told you he respects what you're doing. He even invited you inside. And yet, you act like a complete asshole to everybody you encounter. And now, you're starting to alienate your fans. I don't know why they watch your crap, but even them one day will realize that what you do is complete bullshit and it's just harassment. That being said, thanks for watching this video. Please like and subscribe. It really helps the channel and we'll see you on the next video. If you're interested in criminology, we also have a true crime channel. Check the link below. I live here.